Yeah, guys, so this medium I created on my own from wandering out in the desert, finding these abandoned homesteads, and then implementing all these, all the items I found into the sculpture. This is our Whitewater Canyon area. You can see our water coming in from the Colorado River there. Right there, Colorado River. That's Whitewater Canyon out there. This is a, uh, a rock farm. So, hey, guys, we've been out on all these abandoned roads. And look what we just found. Steve found a Pepsi bottle. Old Pepsi bottle. This is probably, oh shit, this could be 50s. See that? Pepsi Cola. Yeah. So this is the old foundation. This is where we got to start looking, Steve. We're going to get the metal detector out and see what we come up with before we start just digging, digging. See if we can strike uh, strike some good materials. Like uh, we're looking for coins. Basically, uh, we like old. This is old enamelized uh, cookware. It goes way back. I've been doing this for 30 years in the desert. Yeah, he's not that old. Unless it was really well preserved, but I thought that. So, hey guys, this is uh, what we call treasure in our business. These bottles here, this is probably 40s. This is probably 40s. Not broken. You can see the patinas that have happened to it from all being buried. This is a soda company you probably never heard of. It's called Burley's. This is probably uh, 40s or 50s. Um, I don't think it's even 60s. And this is a Heinz ketchup bottle. Back in the old days. Now this ketchup bottle could be anywhere from, I'm looking at the lid, it probably had that 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 uh, real flexible, almost lead-like cap on it. And these are all from uh, the 50s too, right here. Could be 40s also, you'd have to look it up. But this is what we look for. And bottles get older and older. You just never know what you're gonna find, guys, when you're doing this. And we use special shovels like so. Really narrow, they really get into the earth. So, yeah, this is what we look hope to look for, and you just never know what. A lot of condiments, a lot of chinaware, a lot of plateware. People buried all their, their stuff in the desert. They didn't have dumps back in those days. This is where they dumped, and most people followed generations or decades of just dumping in the same areas. That's how we find all this stuff. It's pretty interesting, little piece of glass here. It's really nice. It nice, would be nice to have that all in one piece. As you can see, these are old dumps right here. And a hole down here too. That's a pack rat down in there. That's what they do, they build these nests, you guys. Whatever they can find, they stack it all up. And he's, he's probably down in there. Pack rat. Yeah, I'm trying to give you guys a really good idea of the experience. So here's where I found that spoon, right off the edge of this old foundation. And now this is super old glass. This is, you know, it, this could be a number of different types of uh, bottles. So that's in this hole we dug here. So we'll see what we come up with. We just, you know, the, gap, the ground could be infiltrated with old condiment bottles uh, back then. So, and we're looking for coins too. Okay, let's, now here's where you start getting the some old stuff, guys. It's broken up. I'll get, I'll go home and I'll get to find this mark. You can see it's an old bottle the way it was blown with the uneven circle around here. Yeah, we'll look into that. So you can see out of here, I just pulled out this old spoon. That's back when the day, man, you know, I, we'll look, we'll clean that up at home later and I'll tell you when, I can give you an idea how old it is. We need a makeshift circle of, of uh, rocks here. Maybe it was a fire pit. So here's the old cans. Here, I dug up a cone top. This is a beer can, a soda can. They started making them in the end of the 1920s and quit making them in about 1940 something. 
These beer cans had a cap on it. You popped off like a bottle cap on a beer bottle. A lot of people don't know about it. A lot of them look at it and think it's a brake fluid can, but no. And if where there's one, there's a lot. All right, guys, so this is what we call a treasure. This is in the middle of nowhere. Like I said, this is what we do, scruffing. Somebody been dumping here probably for 70, 80 years. Look at this. And we'll be digging this up and finding all kinds of treasure underneath. Old bottles. Look at this, man. This is just wasteland. For us, it's treasure land, baby. Look at this one, brother. <laughs>